Edition, the student sharing special. Round of applause, everyone. Sharing? I never knew we had such an event. All right, who has something to say? Anyone? Anyone? No? I'll just have to pick someone then. Oh, he's going to choose? I wonder who it would be. How about that fluffy-haired girl over there? I choose you! Huh? Is he... looking this way? Well then, come on up! He's talking to me, isn't he? of us will get along quite well in the future. <laughs> As they say, who knows what may lie ahead. For now, I'm worried about what happened with Akechi-kun. But I have to say, my first post-festival party was quite fun. Though, I guess it's my last too. Here, I'd like you to have this. I... bought it earlier. <laughs> now then, let's go home. Sakura-san, 
I'm sorry for asking this of you. It's all good. Not like I have customers to deal with. So, this is what you grew? Yes. I'd like an honest opinion from a culinary professional. Let me see. To be honest, both the tastes and appearance are the opposite of what I'd call market grade. I see. But it's impressive you managed to grow anything at all up on a rooftop of all places. I'm honored to hear you say that. You know, I can't say it tasted good, but it was actually somewhat refreshing. Kind of like how you feel good after taking bitter medicine. Hmm. I first came across the plant in my house. It's possible that it's an experimental breed created for use at Okumura Foods. Thank you very much for the input, Sakura-san. I'll take note of that. He's right. That was the same thought I had. I think I understand what Sakura-san meant when he said they were refreshing. I agree! I'm so happy. I didn't expect this hobby of mine to provide value to the Phantom Thieves. This is actually the only thing I can honestly say I'm good at. Thank you for worrying about me, but I find the work relaxing. Hey, um, do you think you could help me out again sometime? Like you did today? It's a deal! <laughs> We're like real Phantom Thieves! Okay, I'll do my best from now on. It seems you were probing into a certain conglomerate. There's the possibility you even infiltrated their company building. Perhaps some sort of connection? Tell me about this person. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the Empress Persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. All right. Still, he was right. The taste leaves much to be desired.
Um...
so sure.
Um... Shall we return home?
<laughs> to be honest...
Thank you. Um... Excuse me?
Goodbye.
Excuse me? bold flavor I heard you've been getting into the roasting scene little lady yes I often have the urge to drink a fresh cup of your coffee <laughs> that near brings a tear to my eye well I'm heading home now close up shop for me will you I was finally able to convey my feelings during the company meeting not just about the new chain, but about the future of the company, and even about Father. I think my presence angered some people at first, but in the end, they all listened to my thoughts. All that nervousness was exhausting. I've had diplomatic dealings with VIPs before, but I've never once spoken my true feelings. That aside, after talking with management, I've decided to let them handle Okumura Foods. It's simply not something I would have been able to supervise on my own. And after their sincere acceptance of the public's criticism, I felt it was okay to trust them. As for my future goals, I'm interested in opening a small private cafe. Everything will be homegrown. From the coffee to the salad, I want to set my own standards. It'll be a shop that people love, like grandfathers. And like this place. What do you think? A 
I'll keep at it so I can improve. Truth be told, I don't plan on opening the shop immediately after I graduate. I'll need to study and improve my knowledge beforehand. After all, right now it's only a hobby. Perhaps I should apprentice here at Leblon in the meantime. The coffee I had after spending the night crying. Its warmth permeated through my body. I hope to open a store where others can feel that warmth. Either way, I think this dream of mine will be no easy feat. But I somehow managed to tackle my childhood dream of becoming a heroine of justice. If I act with resolve and believe in my actions, I know I'll be able to achieve anything. I'm so glad I met you. At first, it was nice having someone that understands me. But now, it's much more. There may be times where people resent me for it. But as long as you're here, I'll be okay. You know, I'd like to return the favor. If you ever find yourself in trouble, I'll be there for you. Feel free to rely on me from now on. I have the strength to help you. I can sense it. My first customer. <laughs> I can't wait! My, look at the time! We've been speaking for quite a while. I should be going now. Take care!
has such profoundly bold flavor. I heard you've been getting into the roasting scene, little lady. Yes. I often have the urge to drink a fresh cup of your coffee. <laughs> a near brings a tear to my eye. You're heading up to this guy's room, right? Go on and take it upstairs. Thank you. I will. I was finally able to convey my feelings during the company meeting. Not just about the new chain, but about the future of the company. And even about father. I think my presence angered some people at first. But in the end, they all listened to my thoughts. All that nervousness was exhausting. I've had diplomatic dealings with VIPs before, but I've never once spoken my true feelings. That aside, after talking with management, I've decided to let them handle Okumura Foods. It's simply not something I would have been able to supervise on my own. And after their sincere acceptance of the public's criticism, I felt it was okay to trust them. As for my future goals, I'm interested in opening a small private cafe. Everything will be homegrown, from the coffee to the salad. I want to set my own standards. It'll be a shop that people love, like grandfathers, and like this place. What do you think? I'll keep at it so I can improve. Truth be told, I don't plan on opening the shop immediately after I graduate. I'll need to study and improve my knowledge beforehand. After all, right now it's only a hobby. Perhaps I should apprentice here at Leblon in the meantime. The coffee I had after spending the night crying. Its warmth permeated through my body. I hope to open a store where others can feel that warmth. Either way, I think this dream of mine will be no easy feat. But I somehow managed to tackle my childhood dream of becoming a heroine of justice. If I act with resolve and believe in my actions, I know I'll be able to achieve anything. Honestly, just thinking about my life without you sends chills down my spine. I would have been married to a man I don't respect and lived a horrible life. I'm glad I can be with you instead. Uh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it like that. I meant I'm, um, glad to be your teammate. Uh... As long as you're by my side, it feels like everything's going to be okay. And if you're ever in trouble, I will be there for you. After all, you were there for me when I needed it. I can help you now. I have the strength to do so. I can sense it. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast turned a vow into a blood oath. Thy bond shall become the wings of rebellion and break the yoke of thy heart. Thou hast awakened to the ultimate secret of the Empress, granting thee infinite power. All right. All right. After that coffee. So, um, t today, I'd like to be with you a little longer. <laughs> <laughs> 